We're at Content Keys. Waking up this morning. This is beautiful. You don't know how much I need you. Cause you're my home away from home away from home away from being alone. Run away from home, why don't you? Cause I did. A nice boat. That's nice. It, the, yeah, it's the all electric, so it's a little boat. It, well, it's, like I said, it's only got a diesel motor to charge the battery. That's really nice. They're from here, that Geiger Key. That's a pretty Beneteau. That's pretty. Another one. That one that was hiding out in the bushes trying to steal our French fries yesterday. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we got one from Game Boy. <laughs> this is a nice boat at the end. Huh? This is one at the end on the right. That's oh, nice. Yeah. That's nice. So we left Stock Island and headed to Tarpon Belly Keys. This was once the home of a shrimp farm in the late 1960s. Two canals were dug out where the shrimp would grow to maturity. It's no longer a shrimp farm, but it is still privately owned, and the locals come here to picnic, snorkel, and even camp overnight. This is Tarpon Belly Key. We're gonna anchor here for today and see whether or not we wanna stay here tonight. Sure. So we're at Tarpon Belly Keys and we are traversing the land bridge. Not sure that it's a land bridge, it looks man made just Is a little baby tar um, barracuda that is checking me out. There's a little tiny baby barracuda. That one right there, or a different one? No, it's up on the uh, hmm. it's like the color rock. 
I just, you know, when there's babies, there have to be mamas. Yeah. Where's the mom? <laughs> Sediment. That could crumble. Walking back. It's a long way. After exploring Tarpon Belly Key, we then head to Content Keys. We anchor there overnight before heading back to Marker Island the next day. So, can you introduce yourself and tell everyone how you know us? Um, my name is Mark. This is my wife, Rachel. Met Kevin way back when in high school. Where? U Holtz. In what city? Gainesville, Florida. Class of 1990. And we've uh, stayed friends throughout the whole shebang. Um, had the pleasure of doing several vacations with them. How did you meet me? We met you through him, um, and we instant friends. Went on a big vacation together back in, what year was that? 2011. 2011. This is our 10 year anniversary. That's right, congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> we are pregnant. not <laughs> pregnant this time. It, that, what happened on the first one <laughs> to them but um, anyway so we are in the Florida Keys now on their boat the beach donkey having a good time this is our second to last night enjoying Thanksgiving Day having some chips and queso on the bow sun, sun setting behind us we're gonna have it's some hour. it's happy hour it's, <laughs> it hasn't stopped being happy hour actually but <laughs> um, sleeping. right and we're gonna have some uh, some turkey and some of the fixins. We had a little bit of weather issues mm -hmm. on the on the trip. A little bit of little too much wind for what we wanted to get done, but uh, we still made it from the mid keys all the way down to Key West. Spent a little time last night in Key West, a couple hours, walked around. It's about all you need. And then we wanted to get back on the boat. Had a good had a good time, and I think the weather's gonna lay down for us so we can make it back to the to the mainland. Get back home. Yep, get back home, go back to work, do the stuff that allows us to do this. And with that, I will pass it to Rachel. Fuzzy wabbit. <laughs> Rabbit's foot. <laughs> it does look like that, does it? <laughs> I'm Rachel. Um, Mark kind of filled you in on how we know everybody. Um, been on the boat now since last Saturday. Today's Thursday. What's been the highlight of the trip so far? Um, one of the highlights. This anchorage is pretty much a really good highlight. This is a good one. Very, very pretty. So even though we stayed in a marina, it was a very nice marina. It was uh, Ocean's Edge in Stock Island, which is right next to Key West. Had a lot of really good food, some, lots of drinks, and good happy friends, hours. And good friends, good food. Doesn't yep. get much better. Yep. Good booze. Yes. <laughs> yep. And uh, 
still got a couple couple days left. Oh, yeah. So, you know. We'll so what how many time how many other vacations have you taken on a boat? Not necessarily. This is your second on the beach donkey. Right. Right? Mm -hmm. The longest. We went or for a weekend. Well, we, we went the, it long. was like a Labor Day weekend. This is the longest we've been on the beach donkey. Well, we went to um Silver Glen for a weekend. Couple months. And we did we that. Went it to... went to Caladesi. Yeah. Mm -hmm. One been, weekend. Been... But this is the longest this is straight yeah, trip. Longest. But yep. but in general, you guys like to take boat trips. Oh mm -hmm. yeah. We're yeah. happiest when we're out on the water, and Definitely. we don't like people telling us what to do and when to do it, like on cruise ships, <laughs> which they have their place, but not really for us. It's not our thing. We like to do what we want when we want to do it. And, that's and go the, into smaller anchorages. And that's and the things. beauty of, of boating like this. We're at Content Keys. Waking up this morning. This is beautiful. It got low tide last night and we could see with the spotlight a little bit of sand. You could hear the waves ripple over it. And that spot there. And there's other spots that get exposed when the tide goes out. It's white sandbar. But wow, it's beautiful this morning. side of the boat this morning. Beautiful mangroves. Very peaceful. This is a wilderness sanctuary. More so on the other side. There's another cove inside this bigger part of the island. I'd love to have a drone to go up and see what it looks like in there, all the animals. It's beautiful. Okay, Kevin, you can ease. You're going to go forward, right? Correct. Okay. Can I trim up a bit? There you go. Anchors off your stern quarter. Alright, straighten the motor. There you go. Okay, neutral. Okay. 